Hey guys, um, I wanted to make a quick video. Let me show, I want to show you my ash power I got right now. And uh, I'm going to start concentrating. I, I've been, you know, I've been trying to do a little bit of Bitcoin and because uh, I really think Bitcoin is awesome for, it's a, a lifetime, you know. But, um, you know, we've got so many um, choices here now. And uh, a lot of the prices have changed a lot. I know I made a video about Ether, you know, is it profitable to mine? I think I made two videos, you know, and uh, I'm not buying any Ether, I mine it here at home. Um, but, you know, now we have Monero, and uh, Dash is is crashing, so um, we gotta look at, at what the profitability of that is. Litecoin's going up, so we gotta look at that and the profitability, you know, of, of that. So. I've already actually done these calculators. You know what? I'm going to show you how I do it. So you guys can always do this um, at home. I was going to, I wasn't going to do it. I was just going to show you with these calculators that I already set up. But I want to show you guys how to do it at home. Okay. So we'll go through each one. Okay. And uh, and and do each one. So let's go. Now, the numbers involved with this, I'm just looking at just strictly um, the closest to 1,000 US dollars and what it costs, uh, you know, what your return is on that. So, um, like this, 1,050 US dollars. We go down here to Bitcoin Miner. Okay. So, in hardware costs, we're going to put down the 1,000. Fifty dollars. Okay, we have uh, no. We don't pay for power. Okay, so and we have no power costs on that. So we put zero on both of those. Now um, with Bitcoin mining through Genesis, we do we do pay them a maintenance fee, and that maintenance fee is going to be about forty five percent. It it changes a little, but forty five percent. Okay. All right. Now. Uh, 7.5 terahashes for that amount, okay? So, this is in gigahashes. So, that's 750 gigahashes equals 7.5 terahashes. Let's calculate it out. And come on down. Time to break, days to break even, 443 uh, three days, okay? This is this is really important, these days to break even. And then we can look here at the statistics of, of what we're going to get um, in this. And we need to go all the way to profit uh, on this because, you know, we've got to take out that 45%, okay? So, you can see right here, your daily payout it's going to be two dollars and thirty seven cents daily on on that contract you're going to get eight hundred and sixty three dollars and sixty six cents on that contract keep in mind that this is a lifetime contract it doesn't expire until it can no longer pay the maintenance fee and uh, even if it can't pay the maintenance fee they will continue to mine i believe for a month on it to see if the market will come up to where it pays the maintenance fee again so um, so that makes us, even though it's taking longer to break even, that that's very powerful that it, it's continuing. You know, this literally, this contract could, could end up lasting 10 years. Okay. So uh, the next one, we're going we're gonna to look at Litecoin mining. Okay. So we want to do about, there we go, one. 1,040 USD. Okay, you can do this. Just go to Coin Wars, guys. You can do this yourself and figure it out. Okay, so now we're going to Litecoin. So Litecoin. Oh, whoops. Hold on. You know what I want to do? Let's open it in a new tab. So that way, you know, when we're done, we can have a summary of each one. All right. And I'll put this right there. Okay, here's our Litecoin. Okay, and I believe that was one thousand 
forty dollars okay now and we're getting 80 mega hash that's uh, kilo hashes it's 80 one two three we got no water we don't pay for power we don't have a wattage there are zero pool fees okay so there it is uh, mega hash is only you know you just got to add the extra three zeros on the 80 and you get your that's what kilo hash is okay guys so days to break it break even 269 days and to break even we can go down here and look uh, you're gonna be making 1460 or one thousand four hundred and six dollars on this contract there are no maintenance fees on it it only lasts for two years though that's a two two year litecoin mining okay so um yeah guys that's that's pretty good right there two years 269 days to break even pretty that's pretty good you know that's per, that's a pretty good return in profit and litecoin is going up so uh, keep that in mind okay all right ether mining let's say you put in that's the closest we got on ether uh, one thousand one hundred and sixty dollars I'm gonna scroll down here and I believe that was 40 mega hash let me check yes 40 or 40 mega hash yep all right we don't pay for electricity so that's a zero we don't pay per kilowatt hour so that's zero pool fees is zero this is 1100 I believe that was 80 right let me look oh 60 gotta get this right all right so we got everything in here let's calculate it out all right so on the ethereum mining it would take you 318 days to break even at the current price and here it is so and I want you to keep in mind and I've said this before in some other videos um, I think that this is probably the worst contract because you cannot you this I believe that you're not gonna be able to mine ethereum a year from now it'll it it will go to proof of stake and it'll be unminable we have no idea what this is going to go to in order to redeem you know to uh, for the customers they're saying they're going to change it to something else but uh, it looks like you're not going to have control of that so um, who knows what's going to happen here so um, just because of that I I uh, highly recommend that you do not mine ethereum uh, with uh, Genesis um, you know it, it would be different if you could change this to ethereum classic i think you know uh that would be pretty badass of them to do something like that to where you could you can mine ethereum or ethereum classic but um they're not talking about that at least giving you the ability to switch it so uh 318 days for that one next up dash everybody's favorite Let's go to look at that 1,000 even. All right, 1,000 even for 200 mega hash. Let's go check it out. How does the dash stand up? All right. What do we have? 200 mega hash. Got to double check. 200 mega hash. And we don't pay electricity, so that's a zero we don't pay power costs okay there are no pool fees we're putting in one thousand dollars for our contract okay and let's calculate it out this is at the current market value 
that it's at right now and uh, dash right now is at 204 days to break even and then annually you are going to make one thousand seven hundred and eighty three and ninety three cents so dashes went up let me look at what the price is real quick I'm gonna look on my phone uh, my phone says it's way down let's check this again 200 mega hash hardware cost 1000 200 and more let me see here I don't know what's going on I don't know why it's saying that uh, dash to BTC that's about right okay the uh, hash rate probably has changed on dash and that's why because I was doing this earlier and dash was a lot did not come out anywhere close to that so 204 days to break even 1700 all right Monero this is the new one and some people are jumping onto that let's let's take a look so we want to do 999 and uh, I'll scroll down here and it doesn't have it here see so I'm gonna have to go up to the top mining calculators open a new tab and I go to this mining calculators and I scroll down until I find Monero and there's Monero right there so we got that and uh, we're doing 900 hashes for $999. So, 900. We do not pay any electricity. We have no power costs. Okay, no pool fees. And we're going $999. And let's calculate that out. So, it takes 500 and 56 days to break even and you're going to be making six hundred and fifty five dollars per year on your thousand dollars you invested in Monero so right now the dash is the winner as far as right now with uh, 204 days um, Ethereum takes 318 Litecoin takes 269 days Bitcoin takes 443 days but that's a lifetime contract the rest of them are uh, two years so um, right now Dash at this moment is the best one to mine right now so um, if you're looking for a payoff right away but I think I would not um, I wouldn't pass up Litecoin either I plan on on uh, buying more hash power in Litecoin because um, the price is going up you can see how many days it takes so the more the price goes up that means that this right here this number right here is going to go down and if SegWit activates that the price is going to go way up you might be um, you might be recouping your costs like literally in two months if it you know if it goes up enough so Litecoin I think is um, really you know as far as a, a little bit longer term dash for the moment um, but we're not we're not looking at the moment I think Litecoin is a little bit better for a little longer term and uh, Bitcoin B Bitcoin because it takes longer to pay out to you know to get to earn your return on investment but this is a lifetime contract and uh, 
I think we're going to see Bitcoin around the three thousand dollar range at the end of the year, two to three thousand guys. So um, your return on investment is going to be way smaller than this if that happens. So right now, you know the the ones to invest in if you're going to be doing it, uh, Bitcoin uh, is uh, great. Um, Litecoin is great. Um, I wouldn't touch Ethereum at all. Um, I think you're going to get shafted on Ethereum. Dash is great at the moment. Um, Dash is going to be good as long as it, I believe, around twenty dollars is is the point. If Dash goes below twenty bucks, you're losing out on your contract. And uh, Monero mining, I wouldn't uh, touch that. It's it's way too far out. Um, in order to get your return on investment so anyway that's the video I wanted to make you know uh, for you guys to look at uh, if you want to uh, figure these charts out for yourself because they do change all the time due to difficulty uh, price changes in uh, each coin um, and it's a good idea to check this out to do this kind of calculations um, every now and then just so you know where the smart money you know is going uh, as far as uh, the investment that we're making and you can do that you can just go to Genesis mining go to your uh, upgrade hash power and uh, just move your slider up I put it at about a thousand just to make it easy and uh, then go over here to coin wars and you can click on mining calculators and look at all these calculators and figure out uh, and it'll give you a good good estimate of uh, where you're going to end up being um, on that contract uh, based on current uh, market uh, prices so anyway you guys have a good uh, good night and enjoy